This is the first hackathon at Rutgers for women. The purpose of a hackathon can be anything from a company trying to solve a problem in their software, or it could be you know, someone trying to solve a, a real world problem. We've been helping to get more women into STEM um, because those have been areas and disciplines that we just haven't seen women growing at the same number as we've seen men enrolling. When you sit in your classes, it's kind of discouraging when you don't see anyone who's similar to you, you feel like you have a hard time connecting with other people in the same field. Most of the hackathons that I've been to have mostly been men, so I felt like this would be a really safe hackathon to go to where I would feel really comfortable. We do have men participating, but it was planned by women and organized by women, um, with, with women in mind. We just wanted to kind of get more women involved, get more women hacking, because they can. I think it's important for women to be a part of STEM because I feel it's nice to have diversity in everything. It's imagining even more people with even more great ideas. You can do like incredible things. I really love the creative aspect of coding. Um, I think that's not something that a lot of people hear about. Like, it might be tricky to actually program something, but once you finish, it's so amazing to like look at your code and like be like, oh my gosh, my code works. And it's just like, it's a wonderful feeling because you, you did it yourself. I think it's important for women to get involved in STEM and computer science uh, because they have so much to contribute to those areas. Women are as smart, they're as talented, they're as um, creative as men are. And we want people to learn how to code and get people comfortable with coding. Get them in an environment that's welcoming, friendly, and just collaborative.